Growth Series from Online Baristas. So uh, again, I'm James. And I'm Tom. And uh, today we are filming another episode of our Roast Review Series. Frontline have sent us two bags of coffee. Mm -hmm. So today we're going to showcase uh, both of them in what we think will be uh, the best type of drinks for, for each one. Yeah. Um, so here we have uh, the Bevan Blend. Um, and here we've got the Signature Roast. Yeah. So, but before we start um, trying these coffees, I think it's important that we talk about yep. who they are and what they stand for. So basically they help fuel, fuel the UK public services and yep. it's run, if I'm not mistaken, by current and former firefighters. So they've Absolutely. been at yep. the front line, they've been uh, involved in the public services. Which is why it's called Frontline. Yeah, that's that's very true. So this one particularly says NHS charities, um, but they support all the different public services in the UK. So that's NHS, police, uh, the Lifeboat Institute, mm -hmm. uh, firefighters, you know, ambulance, all sorts of uh, different charities they get involved in. So if you were to purchase a bag of coffee, you'd also be donating a little bit of the profits. For yeah. So charity. all their profits go towards the um, all these all services. Of them. Okay. All of them. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. And I think they've raised a total of uh, just over three thousand pounds already. So really good, if yeah. you want to try a new coffee and also support a good cause, I think this is really a good one to go for. Yeah, because they're quite a new brand. These guys aren't they? They're yeah, they haven't been around twenty eighteen. Yeah, so a couple of years, yeah, little less. And where are they based? They're based in Somerset. In Somerset, where is that? So this is <laughs> in England. Uh, uh, we'll, we'll, Somerset. That's what yeah. they say. In we'll, Somerset. Uh, it's from Somerset yeah. is that way. Oh, okay. <laughs> On the back. Okay, cool. Um. Right, so we've uh, made an Americano. Uh, we tried quite a few different drinks with the Bevan Blend. Um, they were all delicious, but our favourite um, of all of our team and our cameraman's uh, favourite was the, the Long Black or the Americano. Um, yeah, so the this specific one has quite the, a fruity taste to it. It's definitely more leaning towards a berry flavour. Yeah. But it absolutely. also has some notes on more of the floral end, I'd say. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. And but it, it is overall quite sweet. So if you're into you know sweeter coffees and quite smooth as well, this is definitely uh, one to go for. Yeah. So this is uh, the reason why we chose the black coffee for this is that you really get those berry like you said those berry yeah. notes. Uh, with the milk, um, they're still there, but they're just a bit more um, toned down a bit. Toned down a bit. Um, so this one in particular, this is the Bevan blend. Um, all all of the profits from this one, uh, and I believe it's six fifty a bag. Yeah, it's six fifty a bag for two hundred and fifty grams. So six fifty a bag, two hundred fifty grams. Again, uh, recyclable bags, which we really like. Um, and the profits for this go to the NHS charities um, which, together. Yeah. So basically, yeah. it's an alliance of all the different charities that officially support the NHS. Yep. So um, definitely a good cause again. So if you want to give this one a try, you're also doing something good for our NHS. So berries. That's it. All right. All right. Let's try milk coffee. Yeah? Right, so next up, we're trying the signature roast and we've made the latte and on their website, they are describing. Why are you not drinking? You're supposed to be sipping on it. <laughs> okay. So that's uh, all right. Okay. So up next is. I'll their drink. You talk. Yeah. Up next is their signature roast. Um, so we've made a latte with it, and on the website they're describing mm. this specific uh, bean caramel. as sort of yeah caramel notes, rich chocolatey. So is that what you're getting as well? Yeah. Actually, the first thing is like caramel. It's like not just caramel. Those um, were those originals. I don't know okay. if you get that in other countries, but um, in the UK, we have these hard sweets. Normally, they're associated with um, okay, grandma's. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. Whenever you go around your grandma's house, yeah. she offers you Worth's Originals. And they're caramelly. Yeah, it's like a hard toffee caramel sweet. Right. So, um, okay, so that describes this specific bean. Do you get the chocolate notes as well? Yeah. Yeah? It's again the uh, more lighter chocolate roast. The more, okay. Um, like a milk chocolate. Mm -hmm. So it's overall, really nice. overall, you like it? It's really smooth. Really nice. Okay. Yeah. This is more. It's more caramel and sweet, more sugary mm -hmm. uh, kind of flavors than uh, chocolate. Okay. Chocolate's there in the background, but for me, it's the the caramel one that's 
right. forward, is punching forward okay. uh, through the milk. So the milk helps to kind of mellow it and kind of right. uh, round it out. But the um, the predominant flavour for me for this blend, um, the signature blend, is is the caramel. Okay, so you'd, yeah. you'd say that this specific one would be uh, perfect for somebody who likes lattes, for example. Yeah, so we've tried this in a few different formats. Um, black coffee, we tried latte, flat white, a few different... Yeah. Um, I think was our favourite, wasn't it? Yeah, this was our favourite for the signature brand from Frontline Coffee. Yeah, right, that's it. Right, so we've tried both of our blends, so the Bevo blend and the signature rose. We did yep. the Bevo blend first. So we had the Bevo blend, we tried it with uh, Long Black and Americano. Yeah. Um, for us, this is perfect in, in, in the Long Black format. It's the Ethiopian coffee, which a lot of you know, the Ethiopian coffee, it's much more berry flavours, mm. um, floral often. Some floral notes, yeah. Um, and this, you know, tends to go well in the black coffee because you, you get more of those flavors or the lighter kind of flavors you want to you don't want to be disguising them in the milk yeah as soon as you start adding milk to it it mellows them out a little bit but yeah you still get them it's not quite as punchy mm -hmm. where yeah this so is if, better you want, the... if you want to add milk to it then i yeah i'd say or we would say that you should definitely go for the signature roast uh which was quite caramelly chocolatey so yeah on the sweeter end but really nice with the milk mixed in but overall yeah we really, really nice like both cookies. of them and we, of course, very much support their cause. You know, they're supporting all the emergency services, NHS, um, police, UK, yeah. all of them. So that's definitely a big plus. So if you want to give them a try, we'll add all the links uh, in the description below. So click on those if you want to find out more and really check them out and uh, support yeah. them.